Hello guys, Chris here and welcome back to another Fortnite video. Today we're going to be testing an R9 280 here in Fortnite. And yes guys, this is a new GPU. I got it today for 40 euros. So I'm going to be testing it out right now. Let's test at 1080p low settings. Then we're going to do competitive settings. Medium, medium with no shadows. High, high with no shadows. And epic, epic with no shadows. I'm expecting the R9 280 to do pretty well here in Fortnite. So let's see how a $40 or 40 euro card can do. And right now now we're seeing above 100 fps while dropping pretty decent stuff here this r9 280 actually consumes 200 watts of power so it's quite power hungry and okay so we're dropping we're dropping we're seeing really decent fps over here and okay so we're around 150 to 200 fps in the ground here let me open this chest over here I haven't done a Fortnite video in a while. I got three revolvers. Wow. <laughs> what the hell? So, okay, uh, bear with me. I might be a noob right now. I'm not sure. I've been playing Apex Legends lately. And this card actually uh, has a modded cooler. Because... What? What happened? I feel bad for that guy. He just stood there. <laughs> okay, we got him. Pretty good stuff. Let's see what else I can do here. Let's, I hear some steps, maybe above us, uh, yes, I think so, not sure, not sure, let me pick up some shields over here, Let's see, oh, another one, so this multi-revolver thing is actually pretty decent, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna drop this, I'm gonna go triple revolver here, because it went pretty good. Let's see, reload the shotgun here, reload this little guy, no, okay, no need. Alright, we're seeing around 150 FPS in this area, 140 to 150. Yeah, this is pretty good performance from the R9 280, so 40 euro card, remember that. I think this was the best deal I got in a card for uh, price performance wise. Because for 40 euros, guys, this, this is pretty damn good performance here. Oh, as I said, the cooler is modded, so uh, initially it was a direct CU2 cooler like my GTX 780 from Asus, so that's pretty good, but the fans broke, so uh, the guy replaced the fans with two 120mm fans, but they spin at a low RPM, so yeah, there's that. So it's hitting temperatures that I'm not liking too much, so I might change that cooler soon. Okay, let's do epic setting, epic uh, view distance here with competitive settings. All right, let's pick up that shotgun over there. We might see like a 10 FPS drop coming from low settings. So these settings are, aren't really demanding here. Uh, as you can see, the R9 290 to 280. I wish I had a 290 because it's one of my favorite cards. I love these older cards, guys. It's, it's amazing because I love testing those in newer games see how many fps they can get this one is actually doing pretty well i'm curious to see how it will do uh, on medium settings or for example on epic settings if it can handle like 60 fps i would be really really impressed but i don't think it will so oh another mushroom here i missed this one or maybe they grow uh when you're not there i'm not sure <laughs> i really don't know much much about mushrooms <laughs> Okay, so we're seeing here on epic uh, view distance, so competitive settings, a drop of about 5 to 7 FPS, maybe 10 at most, as I said. So still very good performance here, you, co you could run a 144Hz monitor with this GPU without a problem. But again, I don't really think I would recommend this unless you can get it for a very, very good deal because of the power consumption. It consumes more than a GTX 1080, for example, just so you guys can see how much it actually consumes. I'm gonna change the settings now to medium. I'm curious to see how those shadows will affect this older architecture. Now, the thing with AMD cards and older AMD cards is actually they really age a lot better. I just tested Apex Legends for a little bit just to see if the card works fine, you know, and I saw performance uh the performance i saw was right about a little bit 
better than the GTX 780 actually so yeah this card competed back in the day with the GTX 770 but now a few years later we are seeing it beating the GTX 780 so that's the beauty about old AMD cards they really really age very well um, that's the AMD fine wine working on right now okay we're seeing around 80 plus FPS here on medium settings, so pretty decent stuff still. It's way better than, for example, a GTX 750 Ti. But again, that card consumes like 64 watts, I think. This one consumes 200, so okay. But still, this is older as well. Pretty good here. 80 plus FPS. Really nice performance for the R9 280. I'm actually not sure how the GTX 780 did here in Fortnite in the video that I made but uh, it probably did better because Nvidia cards work better in Fortnite. I'm gonna disable the shadows now, okay, let's go. So without shadows we see a little bit of an, a performance boost. We're seeing around 100 FPS now. So for 200 watts of power, mm, it's not very good, but you know, it was cheap. At least in my country, like, you can find R9 280s for 100 bucks here. <laughs> Which is insane, of course. Uh, you might be able to find it for way, way cheaper and probably cheaper than what I got it for in your countries. And probably not with a broken cooler, you know. <laughs> We're seeing almost up to 80 degrees right now with this cooler so I might be needing to do another mod here to this yeah we'll see my room temperature is also very very hot right now because it's like 35 degrees here in Portugal and my room doesn't have any AC and it, my it's like everything is closed because the neighbor's dog doesn't shut up for like the whole day so I, I really have to shut everything off like the windows the door you know uh, yeah it's it's not good here I'm sweating bullets right now <laughs> but yeah uh, the card isn't liking it as well because when I was testing Apex Legends today I was actually with the door opened and the windows opened and it was reaching like 75 degrees at maximum but right now it's really 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 hot in here wow i can't even breathe properly so yeah that's portugal for you yeah we're poor we can we can't afford air conditioners you know well i could probably trade like three or four graphics card for an air conditioner but <laughs> you know i need them to keep making videos that's also why I don't give them away. But I will do a giveaway at 50k subscribers, so don't worry about that. Alright? Actually, if you guys want to see the R9280 mod, check out our Instagram page. I'll leave the link in the description. I'll leave the link in the description of all of the videos with the Instagram page. We don't have a lot of followers, so I would appreciate it very much if you guys would follow, please. <laughs> um, if you guys don't want to, just... Yeah, but... Yeah, go check that out. The picture that I posted, the ac the card actually looks pretty damn good with this modded cooler. It's uh, it's an interesting cooler actually, but the the fans I think are 850 RPM only, so I don't really like that. That's a low RPM for an R9 280 here, and that shows by the temperature. All right, high settings without shadows. We're seeing a hefty boost in FPS. We're coming from 60, around 60 FPS to 80 to 100. Will it touch 100? That's the real question. That doesn't really matter. I saw 99 there, almost, almost, but I don't think it will reach 100. Maybe down there, but yeah, we'll see. So we're seeing here 80 FPS. The minimum I saw so far was like 78, I think probably less when we were right there but we'll see we're approaching our most demanding area in the benchmark run alrighty we're coming so oh hi dude whoa whoa what 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 are you doing man just flying randomly 
Okay, so let's see. Uh, 76 FPS, that's the minimum we saw. Oh, the circle is coming, guys. So I'll need to read to test epic settings uh, in another video, in another match, not in another video. We're seeing 72 FPS here. Um, that's probably the minimum here at high settings without shadows. So smooth performance overall. If you have a 60 Hertz monitor, these settings are actually completely fine. And I'm going to join another server now. All right, here we go. We're playing on epic settings right now at 1080p, of course. And I really think that in 2019, this card is still a 1080p gamer, you know? It compares to the GTX 780 in a lot of games, it compares to the GTX 770 in others. The 770 is actually a little bit like, a little bit behind the 960 for example. But in this game, as I said before, uh, Nvidia works a lot better than AMD in this game, so yeah. We're just gonna drop right there now and see our FPS. Let's go, let's go. Uh, there's a sniper rifle right there. Oh boy, this guy probably has a weapon already. No, he doesn't. Oh, I have some rockets. Yeah, don't mess with me. You better stay away, man. Oh, I hate this weapon, man. What is this? This purple stuff that I have now. Is it rockets with... I was kidding when I said that. <laughs> Game, please. Don't, don't, don't take me seriously, okay? Please, nobody take me seriously. Uh, ooh, ooh, uh, alright. Uh, what? No? Let's see. 39 FPS here. We saw a little bit less when dropping from the buzz. Still okay performance, like on epic settings at 1080p, but I would really like to play at above 60 in this game so uh, I think I'm gonna reshield uh, the guy isn't seeing me so he saw me oh oh no I have to kill a guy with 40 ish FPS I can't do this <laughs> I can't even sleep in my room sometimes because it's so hot it's unbearable sometimes that I go to sleep in like the couch or something because it's a lot cooler you just want to go from there to there to complete our epic settings run and then change it to epic with no shadows and hopefully that will be much smoother and I will be able to play the game. And I heard someone dropping right here, yes. Okay, of course. Oh, come on, come on. Just one hit, just one hit. No, please. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh, that was luck. That was pure luck, guys. I, I can't... I can't, I just can't handle the, the aim with like 40 FPS, it's it's so bad for me, <laughs> I'm not used to it. When you build up some, a little bit of muscle memory, you know, and you just play with lower FPS than you are used to, uh, things don't go very well, as you could probably tell. <laughs> oh my god, that dog doesn't shut up. I actually bought earplugs for my ears to sleep because the dog just doesn't shut up even at night, you know. I don't know why, it's it's insane. It's actually adopted, I think, so probably he's like not used to people around him or something like that. So I'm not against anything, you know, but well, it just bothers me a little bit. <laughs> All right, now let's pick up another shotgun here because we don't really have any ammo for it. Um, yeah, we're seeing a massive improvement here about two times the, uh, the performance that we were getting on epic with shadows and all you all we just did was disable the shadows so you can see that shadows here does give you pretty much two times the performance when you disable them uh it, it's a very intensive setting should i go okay he doesn't have any shields anymore let's see Okay, see the muscle memory thing instantly hit that shot whereas before I was just trying to hit some flies I think <laughs> I don't know <laughs> Oh man it was really really bad and this is still not perfect I would like very much to see like oh I have three shotguns why don't I just pick this up <laughs> But yeah 144 FPS it's what I'm used to and yeah, my muscle memory is built around that frame rate and that monitor refresh rate, but still, this is not too bad now. 
70 fps here on epic settings without shadows so if you if all you want is to play on epic settings without shadows above 60 fps the r9 280 is definitely capable of doing so you shouldn't consider these like really power hungry cards if you're buying a used system only if you again can find them for really really cheap so this was the video guys i hope you enjoyed it another look at fortnite here uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already more videos with the r9 280 are coming soon i'll keep updating the playlist you guys can check that out in the description of every r9 280 video and in the channel playlists so i'll see you in the next one hope you guys enjoyed again love you all Bye bye